So Steve and I are going over standing wrist locks for jujitsu. The basic ones you have is if the hand's on the lapel, I can do a same side or a cross hand grab. So on my same side grab, I'm going to be peeling it just so I can get the other hand over. Then I can start twisting for that wrist lock there. The other one is if I'm coming across, always being wary of that free hand. So I'm always hiding my jawline underneath that shoulder. So as I'm here, I'm coming underneath again so I can get the wrist lock here. Okay? So that was my same side wrist manipulation, my cross hand wrist manipulation. Now from here, if I'm having too much trouble getting Steve's arm all the way over, I uh, come around to this side. I'm going to raise my hand and angle my body, which will change the position of his hand to where it's in this position. So now as I come in here, now I have it halfway, and all I have to do is bow towards Steve for wrist lock there. If I'm having trouble with that, then I'll change it into a walkie tatami and break the elbow with my armpit here. Last one, after the walkie tatami, I can come in, grab the elbow crease, and bring us here, and now bring the pinky to the space for that. There you go.